Play the video all the way through to begin with so you have an overview as to what you are trying to achieve. With a partner, one at each end of the flag, hold the flag horizontally, fold the flag in half lengthways and then in half lengthways again. Ensuring that the toggle and stropper on the outside, fold the long narrow folded flag in half toward the white stitched piece at the top, the hoist, but just about 4-5cm away from it. Then roll the flag tightly from the bottom towards the white top. As you roll it, it will creep towards the white top, which is why you leave the extra space. Turn back the corner of the flag with the strop attached to form a triangle and continue in that direction. Pass the strop tightly around the flag, pushing it under itself when you have gone all the way round. See the sketch. The strop must be kept absolutely taut while being bound round the flag as it must be held whilst the flag is being raised up the pole. Using the halyard from the flagpole, the piece of rope with a loop in it, and the short piece of rope from the flag, tie a sheet bend. Put the short piece up through the rabbit hole around the back of the tree and under its tracks. Pull firmly together to tighten up. Tie a clove hitch around the rope, holding the wooden toggle by sliding two loops over the toggle. To make the loops, Hold the rope in two hands, form a loop by crossing it over itself, form a second loop in the same way. Move the second loop behind the first, holding two together, place over the toggle. Gently pull the flag up to the top of the flagpole with the toggle at the top. Secure the halyards by holding them both together and wrapping around the cleat in a figure of eight style to secure them. Twist the last loop of, on top of itself so it secures the halyard. When everyone is ready and waiting for the flag to be broken, with colour party in place, find the halyard which has the top attached to it and tug gently. The flag will break from being tied up and unfurl in the wind. Retie the halyard on the cleat to secure it. Well done! To bring down the flag later in the day, untie the lashing from the cleat and pull the flag down placing on the left shoulder and untie the knots.